I'm going to open up a hotel here in Brookhaven. <laughs> the first of all, we should probably go ahead and play some signs. And bro, is that a customer pulling up already? I didn't even get to put out the sign. All righty. I guess Mr. Rich Rich here wants a hotel room. And dude, is this guy a doctor? Well, that kind of makes sense. Doctors make a lot of money. Park my car. Okay, Mr. Doctor. Come on, dude. Can I say please and thank you, I guess? But yeah, let's just go ahead and park up his super, super cool Lamborghini right here. I'm just going to park it right about there. Awesome. <laughs> okay, let's go have a chat with this doctor, man. My spider sense is telling me this guy is going to be a lot of trouble. I want the biggest and best room. Awesome, dude. Follow me. Follow me, dude. I will show you the biggest and the best room we got here in Sour Shapes Hotel. And dude, what is going on? Uh, Let's just go ahead and go up. And this is going to be the royal room. Okay, let's go to show him the royal room over here by Sour Shapes Hotel. And dude, hopefully we'll actually be impressed with this room. This is a pretty prestigious room. It looks really cool. I don't know, man. I'm kind of excited to see his reaction. Can I place plants in here myself? Of course, man. Here in Sour Chips Hotel, you may do whatever you please. As long as you're not hurting anybody. And dude, he's actually placing plants inside of the room. Guys, this dude is crazy, man. Why are you placing pumpkins here? This is looking great. No, man. I'm not sure if this is looking great. I think this is looking terrible, dude. Why you got random trees inside of here? Okay, I'm just gonna leave this dude alone. I don't know, man. He's paying a lot of money to be in the royal room. So I might as well just let him do uh, however he pleases. Okay, so anyways, we gotta place a couple of signs here, guys. Because I didn't really get to place a sign that says the hotel is open. And we're gonna need a sign. Because we're gonna show people that the hotel is open for business. And yeah, this is a business after all. We're gonna try and make some money today. So let's gonna see how rich we can become. And this is just gonna be like a super exciting day. So let's gonna type in hotel open maybe like 24 7 because we don't have any closing time so there we go hotel open 24 7 and let's go and get some stuff here let's gonna place this one just so people know that people need to slow down and i can't place it on the street no way dude okay let's just gonna place it here then okay i guess i gotta place this on my own property all right let's just gonna place it here so people know to actually slow down maybe we need a slow down sign as well just so people know that they need to slow down there we go let's gonna type in slow down perfect and yeah let's go ahead and see how our customer is doing because we do got one customer as far as i know inside of the hotel uh let's gonna make sure that he hasn't plinged on anything nope the service bell hasn't gone off and is this another dude coming in there yo dude who is this businessman right here i don't know man we're gonna have a chat with this dude right here and see what's going on and why is he holding a big money bag give me the best room okay well one of them is occupied sir but follow me follow me we do got another penthouse uh penthouse room so let's go and go up the elevator here and show him the rose room i'm not really sure how happy he will be with the rose room he seems like a pretty serious businessman i don't know man this is great oh dude he's dancing yo he actually likes the rose room i wasn't expecting that <laughs> i guess he likes the color it's pretty nice in here have some money whoa dude thanks appreciate it homie okay so this dude just gave me a whole lot of money i guess he's like super happy about the rose room and yeah i'm just gonna leave him there to dance he's having a great time which is cool and all and let's go ahead and go down to the lobby here and make sure that yeah see if anybody needs some food i don't know man should we do like a little room service run we can do that we can actually get the little trolley here with some food what do we got here on the menu today we got some chicken we got some what is that salad or asparagus i don't know man but we're just gonna bring it up to the rose room and see if mr richie rich will be happy about this <laughs> I was gonna see if he likes chicken, dude. He better like chicken, man. Chicken is delicious. Okay, I got the little troll in here. And bro, where is he, man? I can't even find him. Yo, dude, he's nowhere to be seen. Okay, maybe I should just go ahead and leave the chicken on the little table here in case he's hungry. So there we go. We just left a little chicken piece in the room here. Perfect. And yo, who is this dude? Can I have a room? Uh, yeah, sir. Follow me. Follow me, my man. Okay, so I was just uh, driving around this trolley and delivering some food. But this dude needs a room. So let's gonna bring him into Sapphire Room. This is actually available. And this is a gorgeous room. Look at this, man. We got the blue and everything. This matches my racing suit. Yes, it does. Are you hungry or anything like that? We're actually serving food down by the cafeteria. So if you want some food, follow me. Yeah, I'm hungry. Okay, well, follow me, sir. Follow me. We'll get you some food. Okay, so uh, I was just doing a little food 
run, but I guess we can feed this guy as well. Let's just go ahead and leave the trolley there and cook up some food for this guy right here. So he's going to be sitting there, it seems like. What should we get him? You know what? We got a lot of chicken plates. So let's just go ahead and give this Mr. Racer Driver here some chicken. Hopefully he will like it. Thanks. Yep, no problem. You have a good one. You have a good one. So enjoy your food, sir. And yeah, should we try and get some more customers? I'm not sure, dude. We're not getting a whole lot of customers. Maybe we need some lights, dude. Yeah, I kind of forgot to place some lights. You know, each time I actually place lights and stuff, customers will just kind of like show up. So we're gonna place some lights so people know that there's a party over here by the hotel and everybody is invited to come. There we go. We're just placing a whole lot of lights here so people can actually enjoy the hotel. Boom, just like that. Look at that, dude. We got a lot of lights now. Awesome. And yeah, this race driver is standing by the reception. Is there anything you want? I'm not really sure, dude. Could I do some shopping in the city? Yes, of course, sir. Uh, let me just go ahead and get the limo ready. So I don't really have a limo on standby, so we should go ahead and get that spawned real quick because my customer wants to go shopping in the middle of the city and we're here to fix it. And dude, look at that. Customers are already showing up. I knew the lights would help, dude. I just knew it, man. Okay, so hopefully this dude will get our room, but we gotta go ahead and drive around with the one customer and take him shopping. So let's gonna get in the limo. We can call her the limo red. Awesome. And let's gonna go shopping. Yo, dude, I think he's enjoying his view right there. Look at that, dude. <laughs> nice. Woohoo! Yeah, are you having a good time, bro, Beans? And I should probably go ahead and change the speed a little bit because the limo is slow. And I said I wanted to go shopping. Okay, well, we can go ahead and start with maybe Rockstar Clothing Shop. There's a lot of cool clothes here. And you know what? Maybe I will actually buy myself some new clothes. But why? Let's see what we can find. Oh, that was so cool. You know what? I'm gonna sell it with this shirt right here. I think it was really cool. What kind of pants should we get? We should probably go ahead and get some green pants then. But can I find the green pants? Hold on, dude. I want green pants. Okay, I'm just gonna sell with these pants. No, dude, that, those are like homeless pants. Okay, the blue pants are kind of cool. Now we look cool, bro. We look super, super cool, man. Yay! Okay, what else should we show? Uh, maybe the ice cream store? I guess we can go ahead and show this dude the ice cream store. That is a pretty cool place. They got like a whole lot of different flavors and stuff. So let's gonna roll on by the ice cream shop right here. And maybe I should work in the ice cream shop and kind of give him the ice cream that he wants. I'm just gonna try and give this guy like a good experience of Brookhaven. So let's gonna see what flavor he chooses. Give me mint chip. Okay, he wants mint chip. Mint chip is a pretty good ice cream. So let's gonna have that over real quick. There you go, sir. Enjoy your ice cream. Perfect. And then he just pay with this card. Awesome. You know what? Should we maybe take the limo up towards some neighborhoods and see if anybody wants to jump into the limo and join the hotel experience? Maybe some people actually want to join. I'm not really sure. We could probably knock on some doors here and see if anybody wants to party with us because we're basically having a party now. We're having a great time. We're driving the limo around. We got our awesome hotel over there. You never know, man. Maybe we can have like a pool party in the hotel. Oh, somebody's typing. Hello, is this the hotel? Uh, let's go to type in. Hey, sir, I am coming. Okay, so there we go. We're gonna go back to the hotel because it seems like I got some customers uh, at the hotel and we're gonna respond to the customers. So let's go. Go, 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 go. I don't want to lose any customers, dude, because a customer that is lost is money lost. So there we go. We're driving up towards the hotel here. And yo, dude, why there's so many people here? Yo, welcome to the hotel, guys. Welcome. Okay, so let's gonna open up the doors for the hotel and see if anybody wants to book a room. So there we go. We got plenty of people by the hotel now, which is pretty cool. Hey there, ma'am. Can I maybe get you a room? I want to fill out the rooms now. So let's gonna see if anybody here wants a room. Can I get room 15 and 14? Okay, well, follow me, man. Follow me. So I think the other guys that had the other rooms have checked out. So this girl wants all the top floors, dude. Maybe she can only pick one room. Well, choose one room, ma'am. You can pick between the royal room or the rose room room. You decide. You decide. So let's go to see what she chooses, just so we know. 15! Okay, well, 15 is going to be yours, ma'am. Okay, so she picked 15, and dude, there's still plants inside of this room <laughs> from the other customer. That is really fun. Okay, so what about the other guy right here? Maybe he was a room too. Hello there, sir. Can I maybe get you the a room? For him, 14. He's my brother. Oh, okay, yes. He got 14 then. Okay, so yeah, that's why she wanted two rooms. She was actually booking for her brother. I didn't know, man. My bad, my bad. Okay, ma'am, that is gonna cost you $500, ma'am. It's not free, man. It's not free for you to actually book both of the best rooms here in this hotel. So hopefully she will actually pay for the rooms. Not really sure if she got any cash on her or if she's going to be paying by card. I would prefer cash because it's kind of like easier that way. Here's 
one million. What? Why? Why you give me one million, dude? Holy cow. She literally just gave me one million dollars in cash. That is, like, amazing, dude. This hotel is doing really good. Thank you so much. I really do appreciate it, ma'am. So, she literally just gave me one million dollars. I guess that gotta be, like, one of the highest tips I've gotten here in Brookhaven is history. So, that is really, really cool. Okay, well, enjoy your stay, ma'am. You have a good stay. You have a good stay. So, there we go. We gotta go over and see... Uh, have a talk with the other customers because I think I do got other customers and this is her brother and why does he got a shotgun dude he should probably go ahead and leave the shotgun alone but look at that we got new customers and dude this guy got a shotgun too give us your money what why are you robbing me dude I didn't do anything no dude he's trying to rob my million no okay I gave you my money I gave you my money please don't shoot me please don't shoot me oh man he robbed me Stop! You know what? Let's go to chase him down, dude. You, you're not gonna get away, thief. Okay, so let's go to chase Mr. Robert down. You're not getting away with this, mister. So there we go. I'm just gonna chase him down. Uh, that was a million dollars, dude. I can't let him live with a million of my dollars, dude. She was, like, so, so nice and tipped me so much money. And now this guy just stole it away from us? Come on, man. That's terrible. So, yeah. Let's go to chase this dude down. He got a bad car, I think. And now his car is smoking. Yo, dude. Okay, we're actually catching up. That is pretty sweet. Okay, chasing this dude down and it seems like he has actually lost a wheel yo he just lost another wheel yo now his car is burning okay that is really really sick dude okay so his car is burning he's spinning out and luckily i do got a gun and a set of handcuffs on me so i can actually deal with this criminal because yeah we're gonna put this guy in jail man and no did he bamboozled me <laughs> no way okay so this criminal just bamboozled me a little bit and why is he driving back up to my hotel that is kind of strange yo what is he doing dude he's gonna light my hotel on fire okay so he went off and ran into my hotel i'm gonna get my gun up and try and find this dude because he's definitely inside of the hotel somewhere so yeah let's go to see what we got here come on dude where you at i don't know i don't know we're just gonna try and find him i got my gun i got my gun and dude what is going on the hotel is burning now because the fire has spread and there he is let's go shoot 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 and dude we got him drop it drop the gun drop the gun right now sir okay let's gonna put this guy in cuffs and we gotta get out of this burning hotel man this is absolutely terrible, man. My hotel. My sweet hotel. Uh-oh. Let's gonna go down to the lobby real quick and exit the hotel. And can we call the fire department? <laughs> Yeah, ma'am, can you help me with the fire? Get a fire extinguisher. You gotta get a fire extinguisher. We gotta put out the hotel fire. Please, please help me. Okay, I was gonna give her a fire extinguisher. Hopefully, she will actually grab the fire extinguisher and help me out with this fire because this is terrible. I'm gonna lose my hotel. Okay, so we just gotta start with the hotel fire here. And, dude, my whole entire lobby is burning. No way, bro. I don't wanna lose this sweet hotel. And I think she's actually going to be helping me, which is quite cool. So, I'm gonna go around here and see if we got any more fire. We do got some more fire over by the dining area here so we gotta get the fire extinguished real quick i think the fire from his car spread over to my hotel which is like terrible like that is so annoying dude why did he have to park his burning car over by my beautiful hotel and now it's burning and we are working overtime to try and save it but i think this is gonna be the last floor with some fires so yeah we're soon but surely done with this house fire and then we can go ahead and move on we gotta make sure to actually bring that guy into prison because he does not deserve to be a free man after all this trouble he I really just tried to break my business and I don't appreciate that dude come on I'm just trying to make an honest living here drifting like a nice clean hotel and now it's a burning disaster okay there we go I think the last bits of fire is out now unless there's some more fire I don't think there should be any more fire though so let's go to head on down to the lobby let's go and put out the car fire to be honest because this is what started this spreading of the fire so there we go the car fire is gone and dude where's my car I don't I know i guess somebody has stole my limo okay we gotta get a new limo real quick and is this a customer i guess it's a new customer hello welcome to the hotel dude what's up hello yeah, do you maybe need a room or something like that? And this guy gotta be so confused. Like, why is there a guy in handcuffs standing outside of the hotel in a smoking car? <laughs> bro, this is like a madness hotel. Big room! Okay, follow me. Follow me, bro, Beans. Okay, so we gotta give this dude a big room, and then we're bringing the criminal into jail. So, follow me, man. Follow me. I got a big room for you. But the two penthouse rooms actually got booked. So, I guess we gotta bring this dude into, like, Sapphire room. I think this one should be available. Oh, dude, there's still fire in there. Yo! Okay, dude. This is a bad look for the hotel. I was gonna show up the room and it's burning. <laughs> Yo, man. That's not cool. 
okay now it's the now it's ready for you there we go sorry about the fire dude we just had a big hotel fire so this is gonna be in like the only available room we got so hopefully you will enjoy it Daddy, roommate. yeah bro i just gave you roommate like 10 times there i gave you roommate and bro he actually paid me thank you yep no problem dude no problem enjoy your stay enjoy your stay so there we go we just got some money now i want to bring this criminal into jail so we're gonna get a new limo and then we're gonna transport this stupid criminal into jail there we go we got our limo let's go ahead and take it for a ride let's go let's go let's go and dude the hotel actually looks really really cool at night man with all the lights and stuff but did you guys notice as soon as i actually placed the lights then i started to get customers so yeah that is kind of like a little life hack if you want to open a place or something like that just place some cool lights and people will show up so there we go let's gonna bring you into cell number two i'm fun in jail bro bins you tried to ruin my precious hotel so now i'm gonna stay in jail for a long long time bye there we go that was a pretty successful day owning a hotel over here by brookhaven and that's going to be it for today's episode guys i really hope you enjoyed this one and if you did make sure to hit the like subscribe button and i'll see you guys in the next one peace